Okay, I have it most, so I just watered it. So I have this. I don't have any supplies for now, so I will use this bubble wrap. Will place here. It's kind of narrow. Just need the back ready to go when I cut the branch. So I'm gonna work on this uh, branch. I will cut and then we're gonna wrap it. Let's see if I can make it. It's actually quite difficult because I don't have access to all this branch. Uh -huh. Okay, see, it's coming off. Yeah, probably we'll need to do, it's gonna be quite tedious. Yeah, but uh, we don't have choice here. I probably didn't cut. So I'm doing this first time. This is uh, for me learning experience. Okay, that was easy. Now, most difficult part probably to place this back. What people do on the internet, they close this one, this part, and place hole here. I need to seal that back. Because it's important that moisture doesn't go away from this back. I saw people were using straps. I probably need to find them. That's probably much easier, whatever I did. So I'm going to do cut here on this package. That's what I saw on the internet, like this. You need to wrap it like this. Okay, now we need to fixate it. That's probably quite difficult. You know what? I'm gonna get some straps. Okay, I've got this one. And I have some way actually, I will use them. This is pretty good. I'm gonna use foil. And I hope I got good contact with uh, soil. Okay. I went to Dollar Tree and got these straps, 60 pieces, 8 inches. So I'm gonna redo that one because I don't think so it's tight enough. Much better, I would say. I will remove that one. We don't need it. No, at least it holds very well. So I think that's the uh, best option. I'll remove this left, that's extra. I'll put it back, my foil, and I have more branches to work on it. Mm. 
so eventually I need to move this uh, peak uh, at least on morning light. Okay, now we're gonna work on this branch. So here I have some space. It's more convenient than that one actually. You know what, I started to cut and forgot that I didn't make it most. So actually, I bought sandwiches, bags, Ziploc bags, and I think that's gonna be the best option. It's a good 50 bags. Here you go. Let me get some water. We need to put water. Now, I can move this to my plastic bag. I think this is enough. Because anyway, we're gonna tie it with now. Let's continue. Okay. Okay. Um, my little one across here. I'm busy. Okay, a little bit more. And Okay, I'll do some cut here. It's better to use different tools actually. Okay, I hope this is enough. Mm -hmm. Doing this stuff with one hand is not really very convenient. Oops. If you do first time, I think that stops a uh, way to go. This is so slippery back. Oh my god. Oh my god. I probably will do two at first and then we'll tie them. She doesn't want to hold it. Not even water is coming off. <laughs> I have some air here, but I hope that doesn't matter much. <laughs> Okay. <sighs> mm -hmm. I just need to make sure I'm not cutting back itself. I bought aluminium foil. I just, I had heavy duty, but I don't think we need heavy duty for this one. Just any regular foil, I guess will be sufficient. This may be very low quality, to be careful, so I don't, not really fix, but we don't care. There are even sheets there for someone who doesn't want to deal with roll, but I saw they are more expensive than just eating aluminum foil. Okay, so wrapping up. Mm -hmm. 
but I squeeze it a little bit so it doesn't fit air inside. Okay. I think the rest of them I will do the camera and then I will show you the final result. So I got five. I'm placing this one to place with sun until 12 or something. And I wrap it oil because this is sunny side. And because under sun, root will be very hot. And most trees do not like it. Pigs are okay with that, but Anyways, developing will be much better when root system is much cooler. So I have some, some mulch here.